lot they say you're never too old to learn something new and I guess that is true. I am doing something today that I've never done before prior to this week and uh, show you a little bit about what it is I'm doing. driving a big truck. I, uh, my son works for a farming operation and they knew they were going to be short this weekend. A couple of guys were going to be out and he had asked me earlier in the week if I'd be interested in driving a truck hauling the corn. And I was like, well, maybe uh, try to find somebody else first though. And he said, okay. And I said, put me as last, absolute last resort. Well, he called me a couple days ago and said, you're the last resort, so you need to come on over and let's learn how to drive this truck. So I came over here a couple of days ago and uh, learned how to drive it. So here I am. I'm just waiting on the uh, combine to feel. Let me turn you around. Just waiting on them. I got the combine out there cutting. I got the grain carts pulling up the combine, filling up, and then the grain cart comes and uh, dumps in our truck. So uh, my son's in the truck in front of me this one and then we got one more guy behind us just waiting in line all I do is I just take it back and forth from here over to the, uh, the uh, grain bins that they have and, uh, oh I think lunch has arrived anyway I'll just take it over to the grain bins and dump it in there and then come back and sit and wait for another load anyway like I said you're never too old to learn something new and uh, I never thought I'd be doing something like this it's kind of funny all right here comes a grain cart I gotta get off Sitting here, they brought me lunch, ribs, and potato salad, baked beans, and down there is some birthday cake. It's my nephew's birthday today. Anyway, looks like I'm fixing to get loaded up with that cart. This has been interesting for sure. I'll show you the grain bins when we get there. I can't be doing this when I'm driving. I'll only be doing this when I'm stopped. All right, catch you in a little bit. All right, I don't know if you can hear me, but I'm going to show you how we dump it out. We've got two hoppers on here. Open that chute up all the way. It just goes down too fast. 
it'll uh, clog this thing up here. This has got an auger thing in it and it takes it and sends it up into the big bins over here. If you let that go too fast, it'll clog it up. And I don't know how to fix it. That's what we're filling up. Bumpy out here. What's so funny about this whole driving this truck thing is that uh, as a child I was uh, at one point I was obsessed with these big trucks especially the ones with the the sleeper cab in it and uh, I always thought you know one day I'm gonna buy, drive a big truck on the road and I'm gonna sleep in that little sleeper cab and it'd be so cool uh, I wasn't a typical little girl I guess I was out you know I had brothers I didn't have a sister I did you know I play with dolls a little bit but most of the time I was out being rambunctious out playing in the trees and in the yard and swinging from ropes and, you know, riding my bike, popping wheelies. Trying to act like one of the guys, I guess, but I was just kind of an outdoors girl. I even went so far <laughs> during my elementary years. You know how back, back in, uh, when I was in elementary, we had to go and get uh, folders for each subject that we had in school. And I would pick out, I, I would pick out kittens and stuff, but I also would uh, pick out uh, well, one of them was a folder with, with big trucks on it, and I, I ran across that a few weeks ago, and I was fixing to throw it in the garbage. It, it was at my mom's house, and uh, just going through some of the stuff, and I ran across that, and I laughed, and I was going to throw it away, and I just couldn't do it, so, uh, and I didn't really need it, didn't want it anymore, but I gave it to my son, because I knew he was driving the truck, and uh, anyway, I gave it to him, and look, it's, let me turn your camera around. He's got it in here. He keeps his uh, he keeps his tickets and stuff in, in it. <laughs> this can got my, my name on it. My science. I was to use this for science class. 
but I thought it was so cool to have this. And I used to look at this and just dream of having one of these shiny trucks. Look at that one. Look at, ooh, we plush. Got that sleeper cab in it. Now, well, this one doesn't have a sleeper cab, but uh, it's just for green. But I don't know. It's kind of, it's just kind of funny. Uh, I'm 52 years old, and I'm, now I'm driving a truck. <laughs> I mean, that's not like I'm doing this for a real job or anything. I'm just doing it. But uh, it's pretty cool with my green car. Finish filling me up. And I'm gonna roll on back to the uh, grain bin. So back and forth is what we do. Alright. I hope y'all have enjoyed this video of learning something new, no matter how old you are. If you did, please give me a like, uh, subscribe if you haven't already to my channel, hit the notification bell if you want to be notified every time I put out a video. And I will catch y'all down the road.